there you are, me hearties. A very, very good evening to you. It's me, Scotty McClue, and we are, of course, live on the big one, TikTok Live, the one everybody's talking about, the one everyone is listening to. Absolutely incredible and lovely to have you with us, of course. Welcome, 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 I say. If you've just joined us, I'm Scotty McClue. Hello, Fuzzy Kev. Good evening, Scotty. It's a Sabrini. Thank you for sharing the live and telling everybody. Very much appreciated. Get sharing as quickly as you can, guys. We've got so much to do tonight and so little time to do it in because the time just flies. And I can't believe we popped up earlier today. Wonderful, wonderful, very, very successful chats with everybody. And everybody seems to be loving the lives. So there we go. So we'll do them until you get fed up. I say, hello, this is Steve Lee. Hi, Steve Lee, dinky-doo. There's Maria. Maria, thank you for all your kindness. It is so much appreciated. See you, Jimmy, says Tan. Hello, Scotty. Good evening, says Charlie. Charlie, lovely to have you with us. Fantastic. Great to see some of the regulars on and great to see all the new people as well. If you've just joined us, Gonny no say that. Then dinky do Maria. You're a very generous lady. Look after your pennies. What's your favorite alcoholic beverage? Nothing. I don't drink alcohol. There we are. I commented on your newest TikTok, Scotty. Thank you, Sabrini. Very, very good of you. MSN, hello, Scotty Dinky Do. Oh, we're so cool. Thank you, Lily. OMG, you're so cool. Can we be besties? Hello, Scotty. How are you doing tonight? Hello, Alan. Good to have you with us and a very warm welcome. How have you been, says Amy. Dinky do, Amy. So there we are, Amy trying to be a wee bit funny there. Now, what have we got here? There we are. Any trolls, remember, guys, you'll just be disappearing at speed. So there we are. There's a wee guy called Liam, and he's toast already. And we've just started. So there'll be a bit more of that. Dinky do, tell 10, tell 10, tell 10. Uh, Scotty, have you ever been to Tarleton? In Lancashire, yes, I know Lancashire very, very well indeed, because I want their Red Rose Radio, you see. Lovely, in Preston. Um, so, who have we got? Still get the same dafties. Now, guys, don't ask me for work in supermarkets. Don't ask me about pronouns. Don't ask me who I support. Not interested. Far too important for that. Keep that for the junk that you're used to going on. Or just go somewhere else. So there you are. I see you hit a nerve with a lady who called in complaining when you were calling out the fat people. Yes, MSN, she was very annoyed. There we are. Thanks for following, guys. Get following. Can we get tapping and sharing, folks? Very short on followers. So there we are. Uh, no alcohol, heroin, no, nothing at all. Hot chocolate occasionally. And uh, 9 o'clock, that's the limit, so there we are. Uh, now, Izzy, you never, ever, ever ask anybody pronouns on here, because we're all inclusive, you see. Good evening, Scotty. How's your day going so far? YBN, the day has been amazing. <clears throat> yes, Lily, of course, of course. We're up there. We had TikTok chumps. Good evening from Brum. Hello, Alfie. And welcome from Brum. Brum. There we are. Disrespectful to ask Scotty's pronouns. He goes by Scotty McClue. Absolutely. What do you go by? Go by Scotty McClue. Mom the Scots. Evening sources Leighton. So there we are. Now, SHD, why are you asking about a supermarket? Yeah? What are you thinking? Have you nothing better to say? Is that the limit of your intelligence? Okay, have a think, SHD. Otherwise, we can just, of course, fire you off the stream. Good evening, Scotty. How's your day going? Oh, amazing. We're all inclusive. Absolutely, Charlie. Dinky-doo. Uh, no Scotty. Or is it not your thing? No Scotch, no. No alcohol at all now. Harrison used to enjoy a light refreshment. But not now. Happening big ones is Callum. Hello, Callum. Do you like air, Scotty? I love air. 
Alt air wham ne'er a tune surpasses for honest men and bonny lasses. Suits me. There's what you're watching. You're watching Scotty McClue, first lord of the internet, live on TikTok at Scotty McClue. Dinky do, follow, like, share, enjoy all the videos, and tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. And you'll do very well. And then follow me when you come on, because I want to do an experiment. I want as many of you as possible to follow so I can see if it uh, affects the figure here. I've got a figure what I'm looking at now, and I would like to see how that moves if you all follow okay okay so there we are so if you can follow me now and then let me know when you followed me i'll see if that goes up at all also the likes could some of you volunteer to go and like all the videos so we can see if that moves that as well dinky do andy murray from scotty McClure. did you see that egg what a fabulous video so there we are. What about Alex Salmon's idea about multiple parties wanting independence? Well, it's brilliant, Skin Bob. I mean, that man is a genius. Let's not kid ourselves. You know, good evening, Scotty. How's your day going? Now, SHD, I think you just go away, put your head up your backside, blow your nose till the pressure equalizes. Don't try that at home, guys. That's for SHD, who is a genuine idiot. There we are. He's got a chance of being on the world's top TikTok, and he's blown it. What a half-wit. There we go. Bye-bye, SHD. That's him on his toast. There we are. Hi, love your hats, stinky doo. Scotty, what do you make of the link about the uh, Astra vaccine and the blood clots? I'll have a look at it, David, and see what it's all about. Whoa, thank you. Love you. Stinky doo, Lily. Uh, have you all followed us, guys? If everybody can go following. Do you wear a kilt? I do, fuzzy, yes. So there we are. Now, what have we got here? Um... I don't know what's going on there. David, I think David should go here. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Right. There's David gone, guys. I for it. Okay. Anybody putting on junk? Anybody with an inappropriate handle? Toast. Toast. Absolutely. Uh, I thought you would have liked a wee Scottish tipple. Well, Alan, I used to, but about seven years ago, I just gave it up because I drive a lot at night with my work. And uh, it's just not worth risking it. Do you know what I mean? Guys, don't be idiots when you're coming on. Ask sensible things. Okay. Now, who have we got here? Uh, there we are. Bah, says TG. Bah, TG. Yes, Fuji do, Scotty. Ah, dinky do, JD. Fuji things with you. Are you chaffing a while? Yes, and I get kind of folk in the next day. Uh, so there we are. Uh, da Babby. Let's just get you away as well. There's Da Babby gone. Bye, Da Babby. Half wait. Right. There we are. Now, guys, don't try and put up funny things. Could you say this? And uh, you might get me to say a naughty word. Not happening. Okay. Been watching all that rubbish for 36 years. There we are. Bye to the Dafties. There we go. Hi, Scott. I just liked your videos. Excellent. So there we go. Guys, can you all follow, please? Toast with no jam. or oh, there's no jam for them. They are in the bin. Absolutely. Uh, Neve, you never, ever ask anybody what they support, okay? We are all inclusive on here. We're way, way, way beyond all that. Try and up your mind to the big picture. There we go. Fantastic. Uh, first Lord of the Internet, Dinky Do. Hello. Um, have you been... Right, who's that? Bobby. Bobby's Toast. Bobby's Toast. Bobby's toast. There are these guys don't realize they're watching the finest TikTok talk show on TikTok and uh, they just waste their opportunity. How daft is that? Because they're used to dealing with junk. Dig it Scotty's asparagus. Will you be playing the squeeze box? Oh, yes. You are my connection to Scotland and I love it, says GD. Mon the Rangers says Jack. And of course, Jack, we have to say. 
Mon the hoops. So shout it out, Jack. So do you think Scottish independence is a good thing? Oh, absolutely. I mean, I'm not political, but absolutely economically, yes. Guys, can you all follow me? Hello there, says Angela. Angela, are you Angie? Um, so there we go. Did you enjoy Emmerdale? I did MSN. I don't think it's called Emmerdale Farm anymore. It's just Emmerdale. But uh, what do you think of the Royal Artillery, says Gordon? I think they're a very fine regiment. So there we are. I never laugh. I'm pleased to hear it. Very, very good. Uh, Sergeant Bleakton said, who are you? You just call me Scotty McClure. Absolutely. And Sergeant Bleakton would never, ever ask about pronouns. Too switched on for that. Hi from Greenock, says Paul. Dinky do, Paul. <coughs> <clears throat> I love Emmerdale, says Reedy. It's been amazing. I wouldn't like a house in the village, though. It's quite a dangerous place. Uh, CSW, her parents might be watching and think you are just disgusting and despicable and a disgrace to TikTok. So let's block you. There we are. Lovely. Good. That's it. CSW is gone. Um, are you watching any TV shows recently? <coughs> Pardon me, I'm watching Line of Duty. Apparently it's very good, Spiracles. I haven't seen it yet. There we go. Is that the one with Kelly McDonald, the actress in it? Uh, so there we go. Opinions on Celtic. Scotty, my man. I don't know anything about football. Can you play the grand old Duke of York on the squeeze box? I'm sure I can, Simperoni. Uh, when you go, what's your go-to sub Subway sandwich? So there we are. Well, I have so many. Um, how are we? I have a mixed background. First, Scott. Canadian and Yank GD. That's a pretty wonderful background to have. Well done, you. Now, what have we got here? I enjoy a cheeky scotch, but only one every two weeks. Important to drink in moderation. Oh, quite. I agree, because I don't drink at all. The Scott McClure Talk Show is the biggest global and most extraordinary stream. No dafties. Absolutely. What are you drinking? I'm drinking the aqua, the Kunsol juice, the Adam's ill. Oh, and it's magnificent. Magnificent. There we are. I'm watching Sherlock right now. Excellent. Have you ever been to John O'Groats? No military. Somebody asked me that earlier, and I haven't. Do you remember Vernon Scripps? Was it Scribs or Scrip? Scripps. Vernon Scripps. Yes, he's a great character as well. Very good character. Please play Three Blind Mice on the Squeeze Box. MSN, it would be Three Visually Challenged Mice. Yes. Or people with visual issues. Uh, I haven't watched Line of Duty, no. Take the High Road became High Road. Um, did it actually become High Road? Or is that just what people called it? Who's giving me gifts here? A very, very generous person. Um, what car have you got? I'm curious. Kieran, I've got two cars. One is 29 years old and one's 21 years old. There we are. R.I.P. Paul Ritter. Yes, indeed. So there we are. Better known as H2O. Only if you're a chemist. Now, Scotty, how are we? SNP1 Alba 2. Is that what you're at, Kareem? Very interesting. Have you ever been to Southwold or Devon? Southwold is in Norfolkshire or Norfolk, and Devon is Devon. Am I correct? So there you are. I know Southwold. There we are. Kareem, thank you. It's you that's been generous. I knew that. Kareem's just given me a gift of TikTok. Isn't that beautiful? Do you watch EastEnders, says Angela. Angela, I don't really. I think I saw a couple, but I don't know. But uh, 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 June Brown was once very kind, uh, you know, about Scotty McClue. 
Uh, two cars and a half broken bogey. That's it, MSN. Well, it's not broken. It's just I can't get uh, down that low to get on it now. So there, do you remember Sergeant Merton, the Scottish sergeant? Yes, I do. I rather enjoyed him. And was John Dutton not in it? Now, I remember watching John Dutton in, is it Dutton or Dutton, wonderful actor, in To Serve Them All My Days about a public school. And it was written by Ronnie Delderfield, R.F. Delderfield, who wrote a lot about uh, Victorian and 30s stuff and that sort of thing. I'm 74 and still a drag race and a charger. J.D., I take my cap off to you. There we are. Uh, ever visited Canterbury in Kent? I don't think I've actually been to Canterbury, but I've been to most cathedrals in the country. And I should go to Canterbury on the old Pilgrim's Road. There, I should actually go there. And a friend went to King's School, Canterbury. That's a very, very old school. Now, Sean Studios. Why on earth would you ever ask a question like that? I suspect you watch a lot of junk on the internet, you're used to posting that kind of rubbish, and you've totally wasted your opportunity on TikTok's top talk show. What a silly, silly thing to do. So have another think, Sean Studios. Ask yourself if that's the height of your intelligence, if that's as high as your IQ goes, and have another think. There's hope for you. I could give you a lifetime ban right now, but I won't because you're just silly. All right. Scotty, there's positive energy in these elections. Oh, there is, Kareem. No doubt about it. You H, you're talking nonsense. Uh, good night, Scotty. I've got a big day out. Golf tomorrow. Harrison, are you a golfer then? How wonderful. England for the win, says Sarian. Where are you from, says Jings. I am from TikTok Jings. There we are. I thought it was in different parts of the garage. No, but not broken. So there you are. It's sitting. The cars are in different parts of the garage. Can we see a picture of Lord Reith? The dog, please. Simperoni, R-E-I-T-H. There he is. Lord Reith, the dog. Lord Rith the Labrador, he was gorgeous. There we are, beautiful guy. No pike or tripe, no, no. Do you ever sleep? I do, crazy man. I sleep like a like a puppy dog in its basket. So there are name a prized possession. <clears throat> Tick tock. What do we think about those PC programs now? We can't say anything. John Douglas, that was very kind of you. Thank you. Who was the Laird of Cowcaddens? The Laird of Cowcaddens was a good friend of mine. We used to work on the same television station. And he was a gentleman called Jack McLaughlin. So there you are, a wonderful man. There we are, Jack McLaughlin, and he was an outstanding broadcaster. Radio and television. Very, very clever man, nice man. Uh, so what do you got here? Also, you've wasted your opportunity with Scotty McClure. You must be mad. Oh, uh, that's you blocked now also. Bye. There we are, idiot. These trolls are such idiots, you know. They've got a huge opportunity, and all they can do is say something silly. You know, could you imagine it? Imagine if somebody said to you, I'll give you a million pounds if you say something sensible, and they go, no, no, I like saying something silly. like, do you work in a supermarket? <laughs> I like your pronouns. <laughs> Just daft. Just after you're looking fabulous on your brand new cardigan, Scotty. A lovely, lovely lady gave me it, and I thought, thank you, thank you, fantastic. I like garlic bread. Garlic bread, garlic bread. There we go. Uh, so, there we are. Canterbury is worth a visit. It's lit. Scotty, have you visited Wells? No, but I was listening to music from Wells Cathedral. Just the other day for Easter. 
I always see you. Hello. Hello, Benage. Lovely to have you with us. Do you remember Dunblane? Angela, what a strange question. It happened the day after my father passed away. 20, uh, 26 years ago. 25 years ago. 25 years ago, the day after my father passed away. And I think I've shown you a picture of my father. Lovely, lovely, lovely man. And he passed away just the day before Dunblane. And it would have upset him so terribly. Such a lovely man. I'm watching you from Thailand. Whitkuma, do you think Scotland will become independent? I would say so, Rowan, yes, because there's never been a case made for the Union, and the Union is built on sand. It always has been. See, Scotland was independent for thousands of years, and then it just caved in in 1707 because it was badly let down by King William. Aha! Uh -huh. And then Queen Anne, who should never have been on the throne, she was parachuted in, and uh, a lot of jiggery pokery, a lot of <whistles> wee bit of a backhander, you know, all that stuff to the Aristos. And that was it. Some of them settled for as little as, I think, 15 quid. OMG, you're handsome. I thank you. It was very kind of you. You're the best, says Harry. Now, Lodges, you never, ever, ever, ever ask anybody's religion on here. We are all equal. Yes, absolutely. Uh, are you on your jack? Uh, I'm on my jack on the stream. So you're intelligent, spending all day on TikTok. Absolutely crazy. Yes, indeed. This is where all the bright sparks come together. So there you go. I can't think of anything that requires more intelligence than a live. Yes. Are you intelligent as well? I have an IQ of 164. So that's pretty good, isn't it? What are your pronouns? Confused you never, ever, ever ask anybody their pronouns. Uh, so there, your likes have shot up since yesterday. So happy for you. John Douglas, have they? Guys, can we all go and follow me, please? Let's do it right now. Follow me. If you haven't followed, I have hundreds of thousands of viewers. But I've only got about 7,000 followers. Now, I don't understand that. If you've got hundreds of thousands of viewers, how come they haven't all followed? Because this is heading for a very, very big top tick tock because it's a talk show. So why aren't you following? That's it. Do tell me. I'd like to know. Uh, I feel very safe here. So you should, Judy. There we are. And now, who have we got here? Love your accent. I know someone else who sounds exactly like you. Goodwin Deco. It's not Scotty McClure, is it? I would still fly a fighter, but my name's not Chick. So there you are. Um, no, are, are you a pilot, JD? Hiya, are you a leprechaun? No, you mustn't assume everybody's the same as yourself. Notification. Is it spelled Lord Reith? Sorry for spelling it wrong. Didn't, no, not at all, Simbrony. How could you possibly know? Unless you know Lord Reith. I've had the privilege of meeting his daughter and his son-in-law and his granddaughters. So there you are. So that's uh, that was a privilege. I can tell you. I remember you from the last live. Cool guy, dude. Top man. There we go. Fantastic. Now, what have we got here? Uh, I think I've just found my dad. What a hoot. Hello from Ireland. Dinky do, everybody. Yes, tell John to come it. There we are. If this doesn't sound rude, may I ask your pronouns? It's very rude. XXE. I'm quite offended by that because I am Scotty McClure. Okay, so don't ask. There we are. Follow me, guys, please. Lots of people following, if you don't mind. There we are. Remember never to ask any of their pronouns, guys. My granny told me her fifth cousin was the Earl of Snowden. 
Very, very good. Uh, if this doesn't... Yes, yeah, sure, you've done that, haven't we? What's your favourite episode of Heartbeat? I love uh, Lord Ashfordley. I think he's a hoot. Very, very well played. And, um, of course, I love Blaketon. Alf, my favourite. We do like green grass, of course. And I like that guy you're talking about, Mr. Um, Ships. Remember hearing on Century 106 many years ago, brilliant show, AR. You're a very kind man, I thank you. And isn't it amazing, Scotty McClure is approaching his 29th year. Isn't that just amazing? Or am I in my 29th year? And I'm approaching my 30th. I think that's right, yes. 29 years in June. Then we're into the 30th year of Scotty McClure. Scotty, did you ever see Beef at Bob back in the day, Scotty? I don't, UK. No, I haven't seen or heard of him since Scott FM. This is my 13th reason or season. Have you ever been to Somerset? I have. Am I not right in thinking that Bath is in Somerset? I've been to Bath. I love Somerset. What about Cum Flory? Uh, have you been to India? I haven't, Consul. I'm not as well travelled as I would like to be. So there we go. Uh, M1, you never, ever, ever ask people what they support. There we go. That's their business. Yes, indeed. Scotty, I'm back now. How long have you been live, man? Every time I come TikTok, you're live. Uh, live Renison. I came on. When did I come on, guys? About half an hour ago, I think. Hello, I like your eyes. You look handsome. Very kind of you, thank you. There were the camera is very kind to me. Do you want to be independent? Personally, um, there we are. My dad died in 1956 when I was eight. JD, that's when I was born. So you're eight years older than me. So you're 72, is that right? Uh, 73, 74. That is true. Have you all followed me, guys? 701st anniversary of the Declaration of Arbroath. Now, the Declaration of Arbroath was really a letter from the aristocracy to His Holiness the Pope, saying could they choose their own monarch? Now, we've got our monarch, so that's not a problem. So when we go independent, we'll be keeping the Queen as the head of state. Was the Home Rule Bill anything to do with Scotty? Uh, no, Scrag, it wasn't from that point of view. So there we go. Have you all followed me? Now, Bean Boris, you really, really, really need to grow up. Is that the very best that you can do on the world's top TikTok talk show? Come out with a silly wee thing like that, thinking Scotty McClue's going to see it. You really, really need to grow up. Now, grow up. Guys, shall we give Bean Boris a lifetime ban? Or do you think there's a chance Bean Boris could grow up? What do we think? i leave it with you all and take your advice. So we're looking at Bean Boris. England would go into battle before letting Scotland go, says the Happy Squirrel. They know how much oil and whiskey are worth. Yeah, but to be honest with you, Happy Squirrel, you know, who's interested? You know, you know, we need to hang on to our own money and rebuild the Scottish economy. What's your favourite episode of Heartbeat? Well, yes, you asked me. The one with uh, Lord Ashfordley, somebody, somebody burgles the hall. You know, I remember that. Hello from County Donegal in Ireland. What's wrong with asking pronouns? Eva, we're all equal on here. We don't need anybody asking about differences. There are no differences on here. We are us on Scotty McClure's TikTok. We are mega inclusive. You're being divisive, saying, are you a this or are you a that? Do you see what I mean? People should just be people, you know. As soon as you mention colour, 
you're being divisive. As soon as you mention denomination in religion, you're being divisive. We bring the world together on Scotty McClue's TikTok Live. Do you see how big it is? Or do you see how big it could be? Yes, thank you. So there we are. We don't need any of that junk. Pronouns, do you support this? Do you work here? You know, just not using the stream well and not using it wisely. That's the kind of junk that you will put on every stream you go on to to troll. Yeah, correct? Is McClure correct, Eva, or am I correct? There, are you on the radio anywhere? Not at the moment, UK. Uh, Bean Boris, what are we doing? Are we just dumping him? Yep, Bean Boris is toast, guys. Bye-bye, Bean Boris. Toast, 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 toast. Right, there we are, end of Bean Boris. Hello, mate, love the accent. I thank you, Gavan. Very kind of you. Uh, what have we got here, do you think? Wait a minute, second. Important, I'm missing important stuff here. Hi, Scotty, what's your favourite food? Oh, we think the overall food is either mince and tatties or fish and chips. <laughs> Why did Lord Carson send our boys to France, Scotty? Well, there must have been an agreement, Scrag. I would think so, you see. Definitely Edward Carson. Absolutely, yes. Aidan, is that the best you can do? Or are you for the high jump as well? Guys, should Aidan get the high jump? Should he be toast? What do we think? I think so, yes. Aidan is toast. Bye, Aidan. All oh, these wee halfwits <laughs> that go trolling. There we go. This is different, Aidan. You need to grow up. Now, everybody says ban. Yep. Up the custard creams. So there we are. What radio station you on, says Sassy? I'm not on one at the moment, uh, but I am on TikTok. Do you remember Porridge? I do, Angel. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Ronnie Barker, a brilliant actor. I like your program. It's like Red Rose from, uh, from the Carp. There we are. Can you say hi? I can. Yes, absolutely. Uh, give up, Aidan, says Judy. We've just given him up, Judy. Don't worry. There we are. He's toast. Can you imagine stumbling upon Scotty McClue on TikTok and thinking, I will just waste my opportunity to talk to this man? Right? You've got a chance to talk to one of the most famous men in the world. And you blow it with rubbish. There we are. And, and the same with you, Malfoyle. We never, ever, ever ask anybody about that. We are inclusive. Do you not understand what inclusive means? Do you not understand inclusivity? Why are you being divisive? Yep. Okay, so there we are. Now then, have you ever been to Bonnie Rig? Of course I have. I know it inside out. I stayed in East Lothian. Aidan's an innocent man. Literally, he's gone, Judy, you know. He's a ways toast, fired into space for being an idiot. Uh, we might bring him back if he grows up. Trolls are toast. T-A-T, -A -T, tat. Ever been to Leeds? I know Leeds like the back of my hand. There we are. Do you know uh, Harewood House? Yes, Harwood House. In Harewood. No, Harewood House. In Harewood. Think you do. Where Lord Harwood lives. Have you ever watched Vicar of Dibley? Many, 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 many times. Yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. Uh, there's a, that lovely actor just passed away a few weeks ago. There's a good five minute wait for us typing to you reading. So if so, ban anybody. There we are. Who's the favorite person you've interviewed? I loved interviewing David Heyman and Bill McMurdo, the football agent. There we go. Um, imagine going in and day. Uh, oh, yes. And um, who else did I have? Who else did I interview? 
Lots and lots and lots of famous people. Yes. Uh, so there we are. Never ask pronouns, remember? Have you been to Stirling? I started your radio station, Central FM. That was set up by me. There we are. Some mothers have them, absolutely. Jesus loves you. He doesn't, dude. Uh, first I came on, I thought it was an old granddad. And then I thought, OMG, it's Scotty. The world is divisive. There we are. You're wearing a hat and I'm not, crazy man. Get yourself a hat and join in. Uh, have you been to Barrow and Furness? I certainly have. Yes, and I've also been to Dalton in Furness. I know it very well, that Cumbrian coast. Vickers. Uh, I hope, and uh, also I've been to Walney Island. And I've lived in Ulverston. There we are. What about that? I hope you get some more tulips. I like seeing them in your lives. John Douglas, the tulips lasted a fortnight. There we are. Do you know Mike Perry? I know Mike. Yes, I know who you mean. Talk radio. Follow, 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 guys. Nobody's following. Let me check if anybody's followed. Nobody has followed. I don't understand this. The first thing I would do with a quality live is follow. And yet you guys are just completely missing it. Let's see who's following. Let me, uh, can everybody follow, please? Everybody watching, follow. And uh, let's see if we can get the figures up a bit, guys, because that's pathetic. You know, we've been on here three weeks. It should be at 70,000 followers. Scotty, I remember Radio Clyde's first broadcast in 73, 261. Absolutely, Johnny boy. And I knew all the jocks, Dougie Donnelly, Paul Coya, Tony Curry. Uh, who else did we have on at that time? Dave Marshall. Wonderful, wonderful people. Absolutely. And, of course, I knew Jimmy Gordon very well. Lord Gordon. He was very kind to me, actually. There we are. So was Richard Finlay that ran Radio 4. And Richard ended up taking over Scottish Radio Holdings. There we are. A terrific character. Uh, did you vote Brexit? You never ask what anybody votes, but Brexit is the most damaging thing this country's ever done. So there you are. Uh, Scotty, you mentioned the Queen as the second house in Scotland. No, she has several. There are about seven royal residences in Scotland. Can you name them all? So there we are. And uh, she has another house that not a lot of people know about. So there you are. How about that? Um, why do you go live? Why do I go live? I go live to speak to the world. If you don't go live, then nobody can see you. You see what I mean? So there we are. And people will miss out on their education. That's why I go live. Absolutely. Made up name, dinky do. So there we are. Uh, me too, says, can I join? Of course you can. Do you like digestives? Louis, I have a weakness for digestives. Guys, can you all follow me, please? This is getting crucial now. Nobody seems to be following at the moment. We need to get you following. There we go. We must get you following. And we need to do an experiment. So as many of you as possible... Please follow right now. And also, can some of you tell me if you're going to like the videos and then tell me when you have liked them and I'll know if they're coming. Fidget, when are you going to grow up? Yeah, you must have an IQ of one. Do you do two-piece jigsaws or do you find them difficult? Imagine coming on TikTok's top live talk show and asking something like that. You don't have a friend. Your friend isn't called that. So you're a liar twice. You've lied to the whole of the world. How shocking are you? So grow up, I say. There we are. Fidget, guys. Have a look at fidget. Should we bin fidget? So there we are. You are green grass. Should have gone to third race course and it would have been amazing. Absolutely. Do you think I'd make a good green grass? What do you think of the Wurzels? I love the Wurzels. I like the Wurzel gummage. 
Who are you? I've never seen you before. We aid. You've never seen Scotty McClue. This is your education starts now. Your life just got better. I'm the world's top broadcaster. I'm the first lord of the internet. But I was on radio for a long time, so you wouldn't have seen me. But I've taken the bag off my head and popped up to see you. Do you have anyone, any advice for anyone who overthinks and worries about the future? Well, if you think about the past, you'll get very stressed. If you think about the future, you'll get very anxious. Just work on the present and don't overthink anything. Use your very high intelligence, which I can tell, no tell, that you have got, to further your knowledge and understanding. Let the future take care of itself. You can do a little bit of planning. Nobody plans to fail. They just fail to plan. But have a serious think about that. You don't need to overthink the future. You need to enjoy being you. It's a lovely thing to be. And you need to increase your knowledge and your understanding. Okay, so there we are. So no worries, no towel. Let me join. Yes, join Ella. Have you ever been to the Tunnock factory? Yes, I have, John Douglas. And I know Mr. Tunnock very well. And he was very, very kind. And uh, I know his family who run the factory. And they are very, very kind. And they gave me some beautiful tea cakes and some caramel wafers. There we are. Mr. Tunnock is a very, very nice man. I went on a guided tour of BBC Birmingham's recording studio where they taped the archers. Yes, absolutely, I said. I'm practicing my brum. There we go. Hello, Scotsman. Hello, Reese. There we go. Have you all followed me, guys? Hello from Hull. I used to broadcast to Hull, Viking Radio. Yes, do you remember Scotty McClure? Magic Radio in Hull. A shout out. You've had a shout out, Curtis, courtesy. I gave birth listening to you 24 years ago. Amito, I hope everything was all right. <laughs> it's too cold for this malarkey. I've been watching the darts. Gary Anderson's doing good. Scotty, you don't look a day over 63. Stephen, you say the loveliest things. I am a time traveler. And uh, I had to call Buckingham Palace for a new story. When Princess Anne came to our town, Princess Anne is an outstanding lady. Scotty's immortal and was knitted into this world. I was. There we are. Views of Scotland leaving the UK. I think it will happen, Andrew. I think it'll happen fairly soon. And uh, I think it's good for Scotland. You know, there's never been a case made for the Union. So there we are. Guys, have you all followed me on here? There we are. Fidgets by Molly is toast. Uh, you love a wee TikTok live, Scotty? I do, look. I think it's quite a good... I've only started this three weeks ago. So it's early days. So we're just having fun with every day. And people are enjoying it. I get great feedback. Let me check the followers, though. Very poor following. Uh, so there we are. We've been three weeks and we've got 7,400 followers. Now, I ask you, hundreds of thousands, and I'm being serious here, have watched my TikToks live. There you are. You see, a shout out. So please follow me. Have you climbed any Monroe's? No, 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 no. I did walk round a lady called Betty Monroe once. There we are. I had my Fitbit on. I did 200 steps. Uh, what have we got? Uh, if you don't behave, you've got a lifetime ban. Absolutely. Real Madrid defeated Liverpool tonight. Madrid. Real Madrid. Robert Scrimger, how lovely to see you. Have we got football on at the moment? Is McClue competing with the football? I ask you. Celtic or Rangers, my advice, TTV, is go and see them both play and then make up your mind who you want to support. Uh, at a private guided tour around the studio with the BBC Tape the Archers, fantastic MSN. Who have we got here? Um, 
What have we got? Celtic Rangers again. Yeah, it's all football stuff. So there we go. Nothing we need there. OMG, it's Captain Birdseye. Fantastic. And um, Scotty. Thank you, do. Hello, everybody. What have we got here? We are the people, says Nathan. And, of course, Mon the Hoops, Nathan. Absolutely. Everybody following us on here? There we go. You tell him, son. Um, what was the great stink about Scotty in London in 1858? Was it human waste in the Thames? It was, Scrag. And what you'll find that that big square tower in the Houses of Parliament is actually a ventilator because they couldn't open the windies in the House of Commons because of the stink. And I'll tell you where else had sewage was a under Buckingham Palace. So the old kitchen at Buckingham Palace about 150 years ago stank to high heaven. And you couldn't have the windows uh, shut in the palace, I think. So there we are. There's a wee story. 200 steps round Betty Monroe. Is that not a folk song? Harrison, you've just blown your chances of being on the world's top TikTok. You are an idiot. An idiot, sir. Complete idiot. There we are. Harrison's leaving us, guys. Okay, okay. There he goes. Unless he was signing his post, I don't know. <laughs> Scotty boy, you good at gymnastics? Yes, of course. I took gymnastics for anger management. And on the first night, I flipped. There we are. Uh, what's the view on larger people? I couldn't hear it because the woman on your TikTok was ranting. Well, Debbie, larger people need to try and get that weight down. You know what I mean? Do you know, Scotty, George Washington fought for the British before the War of Independence? I did, Robert. Did you know that Bonnie Prince Charlie was invited to be the King of America after independence? What about that? Guys, we're very short on followers. Can you follow me, please? Everybody right now, follow. Tell your friends to follow. Tap, 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 de, tap, de, tap on your screen and let's get the numbers up. Yeah, we're very, very slow. Scotty McClure should be talking to, you know, millions and millions of you now. We've been, it's already been three weeks. So please get following. There's who I am. Look, there's my passport. You're watching Scotty McClure, the first lord of the internet. We're live on TikTok, dinky do. Follow, like, and share. Enjoy the videos and tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. And then we flip. Follow me at Scotty McClure. Now, guys, get sharing, get tapping. Let's do a bit of work. How long will we be streaming? Do you mean ever, Brandon? Do you mean like another few months or a year? We're only doing it because of the lockdown. So we might chuck it after lockdown, and we might keep it going if you like it. Would you rather visit Abu Dhabi or Saudi Arabia? I think both MSN. I've been invited. <laughs> Can you say your best joke? I sold my vacuum cleaner the other day because I thought it's just gathering dust. Hey, uh, Imudi, you never, ever, ever ask anybody what they support. We are inclusive on here. Listen to what I'm saying to you. Scotty, give us some words of encouragement. Remember you are you. It's a beautiful thing to be. Two things you must leave this TikTok with. One is I can and I will. And the other is this is the moment and I am the one. Okay, now that's for you. Carry that with you through the rest of your wonderful life, and you want for nothing. Top lad! So there we go. Hello from Brazil. So, Katie, you never ever ask about pronouns, you've been told. Uh, Scotty is only trying to help with the obesity crisis, of course. Guys, can you all follow me, please? We're very short of followers. 
What was the radical war about, Scotty? An episode of Scottish history. I don't know well. The radical war? Give me the period because there's been quite a bit with radicals. A lot during Robert Burns' time in the 1780s. So tell me what period. Katie, you never ever ask about pronouns or anything like that. It's not always easy to get the weight down. I had a transplant. People didn't know I was ill. Well, Debbie, people need to realise. I know what you mean. Okay, Katie, so it's uh, thinking you're being divisive, Katie. Dinky don't. Scotty, is it true Scooby-Doo got the idea for his name from Dinky-Doo? We don't know. But we think it's true that Scotty McClue was the inspiration for Still Game. What about that? Uh, very interesting. Anywhere we can hear your voice, says Darren. Yes, Darren. Get yourself onto Scotty McClue's YouTube channel and you'll get the link to it uh, just beside my profile on TikTok. Guys, let's see if anybody's followed us. Have you, can you put your hand on your heart and say that you've followed? Let's just see. There we are. We're very short of our, just a handful of you. Come on, guys, get following. Yes, we should have another 500 followers tonight. Now, the likes. Can anybody decide to go and do the likes? Okay. Very, very important this. Go and do the likes. Very, very important. I've just told you a joke. Uh, now then, are we behind with the... Uh, are we a bit behind, guys? There we are. I will do the likes. Lambie. Thank you. Can everybody else join Lambie and go and do the likes, please? That means going to Scotty McClure's videos and liking till we see if we can get this figure moving. It's very stuck. There we are. I think it's heart laziness. I think people are quite happy to watch because we know I've got hundreds of thousands of viewers. But for some reason, I've only got seven thousand followers i've only got eleven thousand likes and we've been up three weeks let's go lambie says harry thanks guys come on and tell me after you've done it can everybody else do it you go to the uh, tiktok videos anthony and you uh, click like on them till we see if this figure moves we've been carrying out experiments can everybody follow me please if you haven't followed me Please do so. Follow me. You know, think of this. Follow me at Scotty McClure. And you'll see the link there. Just follow it. Click. There we go. I have done it. You all need to. Yes, Lambie. Thank you. Lambie's doing the likes. Right, let's see if it's moved. Have you done them all, Lambie? We're wanting to see if this is from the videos or from the stream. There is a slight movement, guys. But we do need a lot more followers. Uh, Scotty, people in Dubai don't watch the Flintstones, but the people in Abu Dhabi do. Very good. Scotty, did you see Joe Biden announce any American could get a vaccine by April 19th? That is big. Joe Biden is big. I mean, Trump was full of wind, but Joe Biden is good. If Robert Scrimger says, never give up the live feeds, even when lockdown's over, Scotty. I'd cry if you gave this up. I've had a couple of complainers on here going, why do you do likes? Why are you on TikTok? How mad are these people? Lambie, you're my hero. Yes. Harry, have you done them? Just like lots of videos, Scotty, says Shaz. Shaz, I'm very appreciative of that. I'm going to see if the figure moves. Right. See if we can get to 12,000 tonight. Right. Very important. We need uh, a lot more followers and a lot more likes. If we can do that. Do you think Scotland going independent would help out the tourism industry? Scotland going independent would help out Scotland full stop. Absolutely. So there we are. Raul. Are you seriously telling me that's the very best that you can come up with on a top TikTok stream? Let's check out Ryle's account, guys. Right, so he's got a few dafties he's following. 
Okay, Raoul is toast. Raoul too much splashy. Gone, finished. What a silly thing to say. Uh, who's the guy behind you, Scott? That's me. That's Scotty McClure. There we are. Remember on here, trolls are toast, guys. Don't waste your time. If you want to be a troll, go on to some dump. DR Fraser, are you heading down the Swanee as well? DR's heading down the Swanee, guys. Gone. Gone. Okay, toast. Everybody's toast if they're rude. Scotty, what's your thought on the COVID passports? Well, we get a brother this year. I find it very strange. It's a bit divisive, this COVID passports. I mean, a simple test would be fine. Legends, says my aunt. Will you be live late at night? You used to go on at 2 a.m. Juan, I might try it for a little bit. I don't know about 2 a.m., but we might try it later when the trolls have gone to bed. You should get a wee moderator to help. He's going, oh, no, I don't need the merit. We're, uh, these people are just daft, you know, get rid of them. Scott FM legend, says my aunt. Thoughts on the SNP? Well, they've done very, very well for Scotland. You know, they've been quite outstanding. And I think we're welcoming the new independence party. So there we are. Now, what have we got here? Hello from Canada. Zach, lovely to have you with us from Canada. What's the time in Canada? Right, I'd like to know the time in Canada. Guys, can you all follow me, please? Lockdown has relaunched you, Scotty. Your career was always rising. You're better than the mainstream telly. Robert Scrimger, that's very kind of you. But I actually believe that. I think if we put this on national television for one hour on a Friday night, linked to the telephones, to the email, and to the text, then a commercial television company would clean up. The audience would be through the roof. Just this. Just me being me. That's all. You know, please make a comeback. My Anne, we will do. I think we might make a comeback on TikTok if you all support me and follow me. Uh, it's 7.18 in Canada. It's 10.18 here. So that means that you are exactly... What did, what did you say it is in Canada? Hold on. 18 minutes past five. You're five hours behind us exactly. Is that right? Scotty, I just did 100 likes. Someone get him a TV show. You, oh, dear, oh, dear. Now, uh, 4566, six. you are a dirty, filthy midden. And we hope that you enjoy being blocked for life. How dare you come anywhere near a top TikTok talk show? Be very, very ashamed of yourself. All right. There he goes. Okay, guys, that's the end of him. Uh, I wish I could call in, Scotty. BBC, listen up. Absolutely, stray dog. Donald, where's your trousers, says Katie? Oh, Katie, do you remember that? You must be a fair age. There we are. So he's gone, he's toast. Thank you, D-Way, he is toast. Thoughts on Corbin? Corbin is a thoroughly decent human being. He got trashed by the right-wing British media who are dependent on a right-wing party being in power so they can, uh, you know, work together. So that was poor old Corbyn, uh, but a very clever and interesting man. And I'm not political. I'm not a Labour man or anything like that. Do you like marmalade sandwiches? Now, Alpha, do you know where marmalade came from? Mary, Queen of Scots, who had been brought up in France, spoke a lot of French in her household. When she wasn't well, her staff would boil up oranges in a little pot and they would shout, Marmus Malade, French for 
the lady is unwell, the lady is sick. And that became Marm es Malad, Marm Malad, Marmalade. Do you like that? So there, I do like marmalade sandwiches, not the very bitter Seville, though it's too much. Um, he will have to live with being so disrespectful to Mr. McClue. He will, do you, eh? He is toast. Toast. But what kind of sick, sick mind comes out with that? You know, he must be very sick in the head. There we are. Scotty, we've just given you 100 likes. Let me check, guys, please. Do we see if we've got that? Yes, I see movement in the likes. I don't see any movement in the followers. So we need uh, so we need more followers, guys. If you've just joined us, please get following. Dinky do, dinky do, dee wee. Thoughts on pollution and climate change. Well, Sophie, what can I say? You know. Pollution and climate change, I think we're going to get it down. I think lockdown will have made a huge difference to the carbon footprint. Can I say hi to me, Yuran? Did you do you can, Sambrezia? Say hello to me, please, says Sophie Green. Did you do, Sophie? So there we are. Marmouth, my lad. No, mom. Mom, as in madam. Yes, madame. S, my lad. Madame S. Malad. The lady is sick. Yes, Madame S. Malad, Marmalade. There we are. Marmalade, Marmalade, Marmalade. And it obviously metamorphosed. See what I just did there? Do you like that one? Metamorphosed into Marmalade. Guys, please follow me, please. Now, do you support LGBT? You, you never ask anybody that on here. We are all inclusive. You need to learn that and not be divisive. What you're trying to do is say, do you support it or don't you? Are you one way or are you the other? We are omnidirectional on here. We appreciate humanity. We are huge on TikTok Live. So you never ask that. Plus, I don't like your handle. So I think I'll just dump you. Right, I fired this guy into space, guys, for asking uh, when he's been told not to. Thoughts on Andy Stewart? Loved Andy Stewart, Angel. Used to work with him at Grampian Television. Andy was a great guy. Very good actor as well and singer. Follow us, please, guys. Scotty, you look so different with a beard. Debbie, have you not seen me with a beard? I've had a beard for a year. Yeah, had it for a year. Can everybody follow when you come on, please? We're needing followers. Where were you born, Scotty? I wasn't born, I was knitted. There's the wonderful Disco Pete. Do you know, Disco Pete is the most remarkable individual. He comes on here, and the first thing he does is give Scotty TikToks. He is so generous. He gives me TikToks, and he gives me dozens of TikToks. So there are best city in Scotland. Well, it's got to be Glasgow, the second city of the empire. I would have said the first city of the empire with London as the second city of the empire. Can you say hi to Pippa? Of course I can, Pippa. Thank you, do. Uh, Caribbean, you never, ever, ever, ever ask anybody about pronouns. That's divisive. Scotty wasn't born, he was knitted, he lives in the universe. Absolutely, D-Way. Did you ever think about counselling Scotty? You'd talk to anybody and help them. Robert, that's very interesting. I haven't thought about that, but a lot of people have said. You know what I mean? Very interesting. Well, I think it's years of years. We're 29 years on the radio this year. And I think, apart from dealing with the funnies, and the halfwits and the dafties and the drinkies and the junkies and um, you know the the jakies and uh, the cokeheads and all that. Apart from dealing with all that, we used to talk over people who had a serious problem in their life or a difficulty, you know, and we'd we'd spend a lot of time doing it. So there we are. Um, 
Justin says, have you ever done it in a bonnet? Why would you do that and then put your bonnet back on your head? There we are. Hello, how are you, says Sophie. Hello, Sophie, how lovely to have you with us. So there we are, Caribbean. So we never ask about pronouns. Can we put Charles on the blocking list for asking your pronouns? Well, he might grow up. We are a big fan of Norman Wisdom, Scotty. I am a massive fan of Norman Wisdom. He had a very, very, very tough childhood. His dad threw him out. He went to find his dad, and his dad said, get out. Poor man. But he's a lovely, lovely guy, and he had a lovely family, and he made a lot of money, and uh, he, he brought so much joy. Even when he was getting knighted as Sir Norman Wisdom, he managed a wee trip <laughs> just to entertain Her Majesty the Queen. So there we are, Disco Pete, thank you. You're very, very generous. Hello from South Africa, says Elise. Elise, lovely to have you with us. Best city in Scotland is Glasgow. Your views on Ken Dodd. I knew him very well, John. I had a lovely, lovely chat to him. He was a director of Radio City, and I was on Radio City. And he was the nicest man. Very, very talented. He went down to London to the BBC and he was in and he saw the two Ronnies and he turned to his friend and said, oh, I wish I had their talent. And his friend at his funeral, at Doddy's funeral in Liverpool Cathedral, he uh, actually said in the Anglican Cathedral in Liverpool because he was a very religious man. And um, his friend said, Little did he realize he had more talent than the two of them. Now, that's really saying something, because Ronnie Barker and Ronnie Corbett were very talented, but Ken Dodd was outstandingly talented. I would advise you to go on YouTube and look at an audience with Ken Dodd and just watch him entertain. But he was a lovely man. He and I talked about putting jokes together. Charles is toast. Remember Nicky Campbell? I do the happy squirrel. Yes, Nicky interviewed me. Scotty, I think you'd be great at teaching Zumba classes. Tell me more, D-Way. Uh, I've had enough trouble teaching Zoom uh, classes. What's the best Glasgow saying? What about a way and bio your head? I did ye, I, I so I will. Uh, I found your Uncle John's uniform, Justin. I think you're just telling a lie. There we are. We don't like liars, Justin, so we'll say bye. Justin's leaving us, guys, for telling a whopper. He's gone. He's toast. <laughs> Pardon me. Uh, big man, how fast can you run 100 meters? Uh, well, uh, a friend of mine said to me, what would I like? And I said, I'd actually like something that goes from not to 30 in about three seconds. So she bought me bathroom scales. Now, I'm an ex-drug addict, not good at all. They just need help getting out of a dark spot. Absolutely, Kipper. And that's what Scotty McClue used to do. He used to give them advice and help. And they gave them numbers to ring because uh, I understood, you see. Fools your doos. So there we go. Scotty, your views on social housing. Any housing is good, Jackie. You know, you'll not get much better built than the old Scottish council house. Double-skinned brick. Places like Knightswood, Moss Park, that were built after the First World War. There we are. Who's your favourite rainbow character? Bungle, Zipia, George. Love them all, Juan. Love them all. Scotty, I hope you're well. Have to have his book. I have his book, Norman Wisdom. So do I. Hi from Beaumont and Isla. Says the wonderful Ali. Hello, Kamraha'u Ali. 
Echiva. I never say Echiva lech to you, Ali. So I'll say Echiva tonight. Scotty, finish the saying, nice to see you, to see you. Is it nice to see you, to see you again? Is it nice to see you, to see you so well dressed? I don't know. I'll have a think about it, dear way. Uh, you know, I always remember Bruce Forsyth saying, nice to see you, to see you. Nice! There we are. Have you been to Fraser Barra? I have been to the Brook. Ken, there we are. Great place, great folk up there. I remember also going to Crimmins. You see, I worked in Grampian Television. So if you were of a certain age, you would remember me reading the news. So there we are. Uh, what have we got here? Raz has followed us. Thank you very much. Now, Elise has followed. Thank you. Thoughts on the portion sizes of food and meals in America? Um, getting there. Yes, they're definitely getting there. No doubt about it, do we? Sort of uh, my kind of portion. Evening, the Duke of Dundee. Because, I mean, nouveau cuisine really means no food, doesn't it? No food. Ken Dodd, I saw him. He was a lovely man. Thank you for telling us about Ken Dodd. I'm a big fan of his. I'll look for him on YouTube. You'll also get his funeral on YouTube, John Douglas. And don't think it'll make you sad. It's actually an incredible watch because there was just so much love and adoration for that man. Jimmy Tarbuck speaks. Uh, so there we go. Uh, you need ours. So Ben, Ben, you're going okay because that's just absurd. Guys, say bye-bye to Ben. Ben is toast. Well, maybe come on later when all these wee trolls are asleep. You need hours to watch a Ken Dodd video, Scotty. Great value for money, a genius. I know what you mean, Debbie. Yes, you actually have to watch it all the way through. But watch an audience with Ken Dodd. Scotty McClure's the best. What's happened to the weather? Uh, I don't do the weather uh, now. We just go straight on. We don't do weather and we don't do news on Scotty McClure lives. So there we are. July Ernie Wise. He was a good comedian. They both were. More command Wise, the timing was outstanding. Very funny. Very funny even to see live on stage. So there we are. So Ben's gone, guys. Here is time I wasn't here. Look at the time. Do you like Lord of the Rings by J.R.R. Tolkien? I do. Do you know The Hobbit? So there we are. Watch your favourite James Bond film, Scotty. Has to be a Connery. I think Dr. No. Dr. No. Or, no, no, from Russia with Love. And I'll tell you what I love about that. It was filmed in... Uh, now, where was it? It was filmed in Argyle because my aunt had a shop in Argyle and Sean Connery walked in and got served. I didn't know this till my cousin in Canada told me a month or two ago. So my aunt was on the counter and she looked up and there was Sean Connery. And they were filming from Russia with love. And they were filming it. What's the loch up at the side? You go up to a... Uh... Now, wait a minute. You go to Crinan, and then you go over the road to Tevialli. And that is Loch. It's on the tip of my tongue. Anyway, they filmed the last scene there with all the boats going on fire. And the boats were, I think, fairy, uh, fairy huntsmen. So they were from the Ferry Engineering Works, very, very fast motor boats in the 50s and 60s. And um, that was the one that they were filmed. Loch Craignish. They filmed it uh, at Loch Craignish. Yes. And so you'll see that. So from Russia with love. What do you think of Rosa Klebs? You know, could you imagine taking a broken pay packet? Him to that in. There we are. Scotty, what's your views on the afterlife? I think the Chuckle Brothers are excellent comedians. So sorry, Barry. Chuckle passed away. I know, John. You're quite right. Nice to see. Nice now. Cameron, dinky do. Larry Grayson used to live in my town. He used to walk his pink poodle 
in the town centre. Where was that one? Because Larry Grayson came to see us at Border Television. He was very friendly with Derek Beatty, who was our programme director. And I can remember one night I went out and uh, I'd just finished a very difficult junction and somebody was laughing. I said, did you find enough to say? I said, shut up. I said, I said, shut up. I shouted. And then I turned round and there was Derek uh, taking Larry Grayson along the corridor with the glasses on. With her, Hello, hello, lovely to see you all. So there we are. Can you wish my mate Dan a happy birthday, says Kenzie? Of course I can. Ken Dodd opened a hairdresser's in my town, which was very interesting. What he owned the hairdressers, opened it, or he opened the shop at the ceremonial. Uh, ben, bye, a vita saying, Ben's gone. You're always live, Scotty. How do you find the time? It's next to the Rosemary and the Sage on the spice rack. Jim Davidson, there we are. Uh, now, yes, he's a character, isn't he, Jim? There we go, Lon and Hardy with the best. Have a lovely evening, Scotty. Hope you'll pop up again for us tomorrow. John Douglas, dinky do. Big Bad Barry says, listen to you for years. Never knew what you looked like. You demand. Thank you, Barry. Guys, thank you to every single one of you for watching tonight. Outstanding live. Please follow me and like all the videos to see if we can get the numbers up a little bit because we have been on three weeks and it would be nice to have your support don't worry about the wee trolls they're just daft this is scotty McClure saying i love all of you there's not a thing you can do about it fantastic and uh, do join us for the next live as soon as take great care of yourselves stay safe and stay Fabulous. I'll sing you the goodbye song. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Au revoir. Zane. Au revoir. And a cheery oh. Dinky do every day and ta la See ya.